Hello! So this is another updo tutorial incorporating the retro bang and pictured here is Shanti is Antoinette talking and there is Shanti's hair wrap <laughs> and she's just gonna take her hair and roll it into this hair wrap to create the bang if you don't have a hair wrap then we have a tutorial on the site showing you how to make one but she just rolls it loosely into that that hair rat just so that her hair is covering the entire rat I hate that word I don't know why do you say that Ugh. but they're gonna she's gonna take her hair you'll see it one side of her hair and pin it to the other side so she's just crossing over at the top of her head creating a bump it's kind of like a crown and then she's just gonna secure it with bobby pins now the tighter you pull your hair over the lower your bump will be which is why she she didn't pull her hair so tight because she wanted that that top bump look to take place and then she's going to take the other side and do the same exact thing she's just gonna pin it behind the bump she already started and keep in mind she's leaving the back of her hair out now if you have a lot of hair like a lot of length you can just tuck your hair into this bump or you can let it fall because you'll see she's just gonna French roll her hair and you can actually tuck that excess hair into this French roll now if you have a serious amount of length you can even create a bun with the excess hair behind that bump that you created by doing the crisscross over so either one it doesn't matter and she's just going to take some bobby pins and secure it. Now, don't get frustrated here. Look, see, even the hair is going to slip. It's going to give you probably give you a little bit of problems. Just continue to tuck and roll until it looks the way you want it to look, until the you get the desired style. There's a better view coming up so you can see the top of her head a little more. But she just continues to, there it is. She just continues to bobby pin. So this is what it starts to look like after it starts to cooperate a little bit. Now, if your hair is more coiled than Shanti's, if you have a tighter curl, then you can do a twist out so that it's a twist out or a braid out so that it's easier to manipulate and style into in this particular style. But if your hair is more coiled and you have the length, then I don't I don't necessarily think there's any reason to do a twist out but trial and error you can figure out which will work best for you and there it is a French roll with a retro bang schwammin <laughs> thanks for watching <laughs>